I was born um, in Germany while my parents were escaping from Hungary at the end of the war. I guess when I was five, we emigrated out to America. We lived in Dallas, Texas for a couple of years and then moved out to California. I grew up in Monterey. It was great. I mean, the Monterey Peninsula is a wonderful place to grow up, especially in the years when I was growing up. I used to always love to color. And my dad was an artist. He was an artist for the Monterey Peninsula Herald. So um, there was art in the home all the time. I learned how to do all kinds of shading and, and using different colors, one on top of the other to create a third color and so forth. And uh, my friends would always be in awe of that. Oh, how do you do that? So I was always giving little lessons already then, and I was in like fourth grade. In those days, or at least in my experience, there just weren't a lot of um, opportunities for girls, for young women, uh, other than teacher or nurse. I agreed to give it one year. I would be a teacher. I would get my credential, go in the classroom, give it one year. If it didn't work, I was going to leave. And that was a, a bargain with my mom, and she accepted it. Turned out that my first year of teaching was just wonderful. It was a wonderful, wonderful experience. And so I continued. And as it turns out, I was a teacher for 37 years. Now, how does that tie together with art? From day one, art was always a focus in my classroom in one form or another. Uh, I really believed in um, hands-on learning, so everything was projects and everything was um, uh, interactive in one form or another. I tried to limit paper pencil drills and so forth. So my first year of teaching, I think, is when the art really became an integral part of my life. I, I love color, so I use a lot of color in my work. They're mostly an expression of just color, texture, and whatever the mood is that, that I'm in at the, at the moment. That's why they're in all different colors. I have some that are red. Does that mean that I was angry at the time? No, <laughs> not necessarily. For somebody who's thinking of exploring art, it's get, it, get out and see art. Don't allow your fear of trying out something in the art arena to keep you from trying it because everybody have insecurities about is this going to be good enough. It doesn't require that you have this inordinate amount of talent before you start.